Hi, this is Pat Love from Love Healing Hearts. Now, one thing I just want to say real quick, it's going to be real quick, is for all of you people who minister in any way, this is where I fell short, and that's how I, I, came, I came against that demonic attack. Watch yourself right before you know you have to minister. It's almost better to do the spiritual warfare before the attack even comes. So I have to get in that habit to remember that four or five days, two or three days before I'm scheduled to sing somewhere, speak, whatever, that I am getting ready to be attacked just because they can. So, and they don't like when you minister and you encourage other people or whatever the case may be. So what I have to get in the habit of doing, and I'm saying this for both you and me. This is this is a um, two-edged sword here. It's cutting both ways. We have to remember to do battle before, as we are preparing to do ministry. We have to do battle to cover ourselves, protect ourselves. Do you see what I mean? I remembered years ago when I was taking inner healing and deliverance courses. They would tell you to pray against the retaliation. You pray before, you pray during, and you pray after. Now I'm keeping this tape for me. So that's, I had totally forgotten that I was scheduled to minister today. And that attack took place either the last night or the night before last. Yeah. So you have to remember to be to prepare, just get ready. Just know that you're dealing with something nasty and evil. And you have to be ready, as they say, on the ready at all times. So that's the main thing I want to say. Be prayed up. Do battle. Before you go to bed, I mean, I had gotten in the habit of doing that because a while back I was getting attacked left and right because I was I was ministering more often at that point. And it didn't it just hit me just now. It was always at the time of ministry. So, um, duh. Yeah, I know. Hmm. Yeah, I should have known that by now. Right. <laughs> anyway. Um, so we have to pray. We have to get into the word. We have to rebuke the devil and forbid him from attacking you. We have to uh, pray the covering of the Holy Spirit and the presence of God and all of that. Then we also have to pray against retaliation after the ministry. I forbid you, Satan, to do any retaliation in the name of Jesus, I'm meaning this while I'm saying it so you can hear how I'm doing it. I cancel every plan of retaliation. No weapon formed against me and mine will prosper. No weapon. No, You will not touch my family members by blood. You will not touch my friends. You will not touch anybody that I associate with that I go to church with, I rebuke all of that in the name of Jesus. You will not touch my stuff. You will not touch my body. I rebuke you in the name of Jesus. I cancel the assignment of the enemy in the name of Jesus. Done. That's what we have to do before, during, and after. Lesson complete. God bless you. Just try to keep that in mind when you're getting ready to, when you're scheduled to have to do anything, whether it's prison ministry, street ministry, feeding the poor, whatever. If it's in the name of Jesus, you make sure you cover yourself. God bless you.